Well, let's get it in. By the way, yo, 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 it's Terrell, Hall of Fame, D-Line, TBKC, and all that sweet, beautiful, wonderful shit. It's going to be a lot of videos uh, up today, and I actually, I'm seriously planning on going live tomorrow morning. Um, let's talk about it. Today's been weird, I, I, by the way. I, I was pushing massive weight trying to get back to myself, but um, yeah, <laughs> surprised myself a little bit today in that gym. I done got a little stronger. Old man still getting stronger. But uh, anyway... Everybody's hitting me up about this post that Dave Wilson made, of course. And uh, he's talking about that some people, uh, you know what I'm saying, stop it. I forget the exact quote, but some people, you know, still stuck in high school. Some people um, go to college and then some people is in the NFL. And the, 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 the old dogs is the, you know, the people who stuck uh, with the old dogs is wearing leather helmets. Some corny shit like that. And so this is what I'm saying, right? Um, let's just be real, and it's annoying me if you keep on seeing me I parked by a, a tree and the birds just destroyed my car. But, um, let's be real. If Dave Wilson is telling you flat out that if you like the Remy's, you like the Pacos, you like the Mufasa's, you like the Pokemon's, you like the Denzel's, you like the Master Shifu's, you like the, you know what I mean? All of these dogs that were from the past, uh, some not so distant past, and he's telling you that they're not extreme. Those are some high school uh, <laughs> leather, leather helmet wearing bullies, and you're not welcome to the ABKC. Stop spending your fucking money with him. And I'm just telling you this, like I said, you don't have to register with me, although we have made significant progress in the last week so y'all will be able to register with me here very shortly but register with somebody else stop supporting somebody who is making an obvious effort to not only insult your taste in dogs to not only continue to do things that are detrimental to this community but is now very very arrogant and flamboyant about it throwing insults at the dogs that built this breed this is all i'm saying you don't have to like me you don't have to like whatever but if if you like pokemon if that if you have clean american bullies if you have dogs that are not extreme dogs it, and, and he keeps telling you that your dog does not fit in the abkc that's a old uh this that and the other i mean it, it to me is it to, to me the most classless thing about his actions i'm not even going to talk about his registry but the most classless thing about this is the simple fact that how is it that you allow for a dog like King Kong to be a, called a grand champion in your registry, but you throw shade at a dog like Paco? How is it that you are throwing shade at the dogs that built this registry, that built this community, that built this breed, that has made this breed popular worldwide, that lived a long time? Y'all heard me say this, that were for the most part pretty healthy dogs that made the American bully what it is, but because you made a deal with the devil, now all of a sudden the whole breed is supposed to be something different. We'll talk about this tomorrow, but like I told y'all, Operation, uh, let's just call it, Operation Leather Helmet. We about to get it going. Y'all stay tuned. I got some nice shirts with the leather helmet, the TVKC logo on there. We call them leather helmet bullies from here on now. We good. We doing our thing, man. We gonna have fun with this. But if y'all hear me say leather helmet bullies, that's just the funniest thing, especially from a guy who doesn't have an uh, athletic bone in his body talking about football. But I, I'll take my leather helmet bully all day for, for one specific reason. My dogs are healthy. My dogs are still massive. I got 100 pound dogs. I got 100 pound pockets. I got dogs that can breathe that can function, that can go out in the sun, that don't need to go to the vet every three days. Uh, it, great things are coming up. But like I say, if you're down with the real American bullies and you're not on this unhealthy, long back, overdone, bad joints, bad elbow, bad heart, bad breathing shit that the ABKC is pushing, find you a registry that messes with them. Stop spending your money with a clown who's insulting your breeding stock and, and what this breed is supposed to be. Until next time, God bless you. Much love. Peace.